we're going to go over what a profile adjustment is for a select few of the vertical geometry commands. Uh, what I have here is a, just a simple horizontal line and I have opened a profile model and I'm going to project the profile from my main line onto this uh, using a slope. For simplicity I'm going to use a slope of zero just so we can show what some of these uh, profile adjustments are. So I'm going to come in and I'm going to do a profile by slope from element. Okay, I'm going to select this element and then for the reference element I'm going to select my main line and like I said I'm going to put in a slope of zero. Uh, you can put whatever value here you need. Uh, I'm going to select all and then we're going to start out doing a profile adjustment of none and I'm going to show you the three different options. We have none, minimum, and maximum. Uh, and now I'm going to put in a vertical offset of zero. So this is just going to be a straight projection uh, from our baseline element to our horizontal. Okay, so it's projected this alignment. And now we're going to do the same type of slope projection, uh, but I'm going to set the minimum and the maximum. Okay, so if I do a um, profile by slope, let me select this, reset, select our reference element, stick with our 0% slope and now for the profile adjustment we're going to do a minimum. Okay, So if we left click on that and we accept our zero you'll see that what it's doing is it's, it is adjusting our profile based on the minimum elevation that we're projecting. It's this minimum elevation so it assigns that as the entire profile. It's going to do the same thing for our, our maximum. Okay, So we're going to do this again. Reset and we're going to select maximum as our profile adjustment. And you'll see that we'll get a vertical offset of zero and it is using the maximum elevation for the profile adjustment. You see that for this vertical curvature it's picking that max elevation. So that's what the profile adjustment is in the vertical geometry tools.